Tell us about chicken's liver today. Hey guys, it's some time for some more liver talk with Pappy and friends. This time our audience had to leave though. They were wore out after the end of the show. I worried by you. Anyways, now it's just me, Nana, and Pap. Here again with a brand new video to satisfy your 14 mm. carat mind. <laughs> Take power with me, you Pappy. Mm. I said, me. Now it's just me, you, Nana, and Pap. Mm. That's right. Mm. Me, you, and Nana. You had four people. You, me, Nana, and Pap. <laughs> four people. Where's the fourth on that? Huh? He's hid over in the closet. <laughs> Cut it out, have you? Uh, okay, so this time we got. Uh, he's that white zombie. You, Nana, and me. <laughs> you, Nana, and me. And That's what you said. Well, that was a typo. <laughs> Ain't no typo. That's what you said. Well, anyways, the people had to leave. They they got more out of laughing. I get more out talking. <laughs> you sure about that? Yes, I do. Yeah. Well, and it's now this time we got Pap, me, and Nina yeah. here to satisfy your 14 carat mind. I spent seven sawmill dollars. Bought you a brace. Don't you have to talk about liver or something? Just to satisfy your 14 carat mind. Yeah, how do you, when you kill chickens, how do you get their liver out, Pappy? You split them open or roll them out. <laughs> <laughs> Was it easier than getting the hog liver out? No, liver? I don't know. You just cut a hog right down the belly and slide them right out. <laughs> just roll them out in a tub. <laughs> That's what you do. Then you talk about 10 gallons. It's 2017, Pap. People don't do that they no more. They still kill a hog the same way in 2017. Yeah, but now we got some cool technology tools. What technology have you got? I don't know. I'm sure we got some. Uh, they, you, you ain't no technology. The United States is one of the richest places in the world, Pap. All right, it might be. <laughs> but you still kill a hog. But you got China. <laughs> You still kill a hog. But you got a China and Japan. <laughs> but you're ruining the market, by the way. We used to put a big barrel of water. Are you still talking? I ain't gonna tell about chicken now. <laughs> no, I'm telling about a hog. He said they had modern technology. We live in the hog. Yeah, they've got the automatic automatic axe. What you do is press a button, it shoots out axes and everything. I'd say a chicken, you hook a hose up and suck it out. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's about as good as any of it. I would have to mark him way to do it. Pep's always there for I don't a friend. Know. How, how, how do they get it out of a chicken that you uh, satisfy your 14th hair of mine? You're going to roast. I don't know. I don't know. Hey, hey, it's Farmer Pap over here. Knows everything about old civilization. I don't know how to get it out of you. How do you uh, what about a turkey? I'm a gobble chop. <laughs> I guess I'll just reach up and I'll pull the gut inside out. Oh, gosh! <laughs> no, Nana, it's... No, Nana, it's gobble gobble gu <laughs> gobble gobble chop. After they cut his head off... After they cut its head off, you can't do anything with it. Get all this order. I don't know. I'm a farmer. Don't you way. dare, Pappy. Don't tell the real way how to do it. Huh? <laughs> don't tell the real way how to do it. I don't know how to do it. He knows how, guys. <laughs> I never did kill a chicken. Now that right there is what I call getting your mind in the gutter. <laughs> I never did kill a chicken. That's not how you do it, Nana. Well, you did when I went to farm and y'all shooting them out of the tree. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us about that, Pat. <laughs> well, we tried to run them down, we couldn't catch them, so I went and got my gun and went shoot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I got that in the trees, too. I couldn't shoot them, so I, I mean, catch them, so I just shot them. You just run in the fan, because she's hot. She's a hot tamale. She's always so hot. She's a burrito. Eating my daily apple. She's Eating your daily apple. She's a burrito. A burrito. A burrito. With the uh, jalapeno peppers. <laughs> Boy. 
Thank That's you. That's right. She got to run in the van. She's a burrito. I can or, tell. What, what's them other things? Jalapeno. The uh, soft shell tacos. A taco with jalapeno peppers. Pappy, do you even know what you are? What am I? Or taco. A taco. I don't like tacos. Yeah, you're definitely a donkey. Uh, <laughs> I got two legs. I ain't got four legs. You a orangutan. Orangutans are very cool animals, Pap. <laughs> they have a cool tail. They've got a great grip. They also love to jump around and have a lot of fun. You know what a orangutan is, don't you? That's it's a, a monkey. That's a, 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 a big ugly monkey. <laughs> that's not the ugly one. Have you seen baby orangutans, Pappy? No. Their little face. Oh, they're so cute. Yeah. They're like you, but they don't look. They don't, they're like this. Like, <laughs> they look a lot like Pappy, do they? They look like Pappy, but they're more handsome. I bet they look just like Pappy's baby picture. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what, you already... What is your baby picture, Pap? Huh? Has that ever been recorded? No. <laughs> really? What? It's Miss Link. <laughs> Pappy doesn't have a baby photo. I'm Miss Link. Pappy, you're supposed to have a baby photo. No, I'm Miss Link. Were cameras even out then? No. They might have been. We didn't have one. We were so poor. And they had to tie a pork chop around your neck get the dog to play with you. <laughs> that's called being pitiful, not poor. That's, uh, no, that's called being ugly. <laughs> well, you should know about that. that. Well, they tied a big pork chop. <laughs> they tied a pork chop around my neck get the dog to play with me. <laughs> wow, kind of that ugly. Yeah. You must have been so ugly. You're, well, did you have a mirror? I was so ugly, I fell out of the ugly tree and hit every <laughs> limb on the way down. <laughs> That's how ugly I was. How? Hey, and my poor mom said, if I know you are going to look like that, I'd have killed you when you were born. <laughs> God! I said, oh, Lord. <laughs> 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 I can't hear it because I was I don't like, think your mama said that. She probably thought you was pretty. Mm -hmm. Oh, boy. Mm -hmm. Light flickers sometimes. I was a pretty yeah, baby. Kind of, so. Yeah, your baby pictures, you, you are pretty, I don't say that. Long hair. I was a pretty baby. A pretty baby. A pretty baby. <laughs> it turned out to be one of the best YouTubers in the world. Yeah, best looking man you ever seen. Oh, I'm sure. <laughs> Nana said when she seen me, she thought uh, a movie star had come to town. <laughs> <laughs> in your dreams, Pappy. <laughs> I was like, you. Th I was like, you got that backwards. That's what you thought about me. I said, Lord, look at that beautiful woman. I got to take her home. You got, marry me, marry me, please, marry me. I said, I'm going to get that woman. Went over there, not done crying. I have to go home and get my shotgun. And bagged her. Uh, uh, yeah, man, I thought that was a movie star coming to town. I'm sure. You know, back in, I see who was who was proper back in to Elvis Presley, mm -hmm. Buddy Holly, and all them. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, Pep's totally Elvis. <laughs> no, I wasn't Elvis. Tell us about your Elvis story. I don't know. I, ain't, I don't have no Elvis story. I don't think I've got my a... Elvis story. Is there some man with the guitar that thinks he's better than everybody? Yeah, my Elvis was good. I knowed him. He did. Yeah, me and him. Rock and roll king. We were, we, we, we the to, king of rock and roll. We used to beat a lot of rock down Tupelo, Mississippi. <laughs> <laughs> That's where he's from, Tupelo. I thought you went to an Elvis concert, Nana. You did. You did? Oh, you not see. You see him? Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, I said I went to see him on the stage. I had to look at it through the not. I look at him through the not, which I was sitting up at the top. And you so, seen him, old did you? Yeah. Did you talk to him? No, he was on stage. We should right up there and go. I'm your biggest fan. I, mean, I was up in the balcony, and there was thousands of people there. Thousands of people. Well, squeeze your way through. You're you would go to jail anyways. 
Actually, You'd be in security, the security go, okay, let's move it. Go, no, no. <laughs> hey, you, you ever get to, you went and seen Thomas the Train, didn't you? A long time ago. I went and seen, seen Casey the Engineer. That was like when I was like three or four. You, uh, we you, went and saw George Jones. Well, yeah, your uh, daddy went and seen the Harlem Globetrotters. He did? Yeah, sure, it's like him. Uh, yeah, and a deal. Robbie Yeah. Yeah. Well, I just, maybe this she didn't. I thought the only she, famous, I a lot of stuff. the only famous person I've ever met. Is me. No, the only famous person I've ever actually talked to is voice actor for Eggman and Sonic. <laughs> <laughs> you talk to? Him? Yeah. Where at? Their text message. Oh. <laughs> mm. Let's see what. His name's Mike. Yo, Mike, if you're listening to this, you rule, buddy. Let's <laughs> see what famous oh, yeah, name that I ever talked. Oh yeah. Also, Mike, if you're watching this, Pap is a complete nut. <laughs> yeah. I went and watched uh, Elvis Presley. I went and seen George Jones. And I went and seen Conway Twiggy, but I never get talked to none of them. Yeah, and Nina's like, talk to me, talk to me. And Elvis is like, can I get a security on this woman? I went to the famous person I ever seen was John Wayne. One time I thought <laughs> to him, me and him rode horses together. <laughs> Where was that at? That was in the... Was you in a movie with him? That was when we were down in the Louisiana swamps. That's when he was down there making the... Money? Uh, the horse soldier. <laughs> and I rode a horse through there with him. Snooze fest. What else is playing? Huh? Snooze fest, what else is going on? <laughs> no, the only famous person I actually ever, ever, ever saw. You know who the famous person I ever saw? Who, who? No one. Who? I've never seen anybody famous. <laughs> You've seen me. I'm famous. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm sure. You got, you've even got your mansion, Pat. Yeah. I used to ride wild horses. We got a mansion in heaven when we die. Yeah, but we're talking about life. You know, I rode a wild horse one time. I did ride a wild horse or something. Oh! Did you? What? No. <laughs> Nina's, Nina's feeling some weird smells, and no, I did not. I had a wild horse down there. Okay, let's just stop talking about that. Uh, Anyways, uh, Pat, talk about some celebrities, you know. Well, that's what I'm fixing to tell you. I was uh, down in Alabama, and they caught this wild horse. Kicked him. No, and every, all of us trying to ride him. Well. I rode him, but he run right into the barn and tried to scrub me off on the barn. <laughs> <laughs> He's a wild little horse, boy. Now, is that the truth or is that that's the tale? That's true, that's true. <laughs> Whose horse was it? That was a Marie and them when they lived in Gadsden. Did Alabama. it feel weird? Or Joanne when they lived in Gadsden. Did it feel weird, Pappy? Yeah, I like to ride horses. So. But no, whenever it scrubbed you. Like, well, I know what it's trying to do. It tried to rake me off again tomorrow. <laughs> did, it, did it hurt? I, I got my leg out of the way. I remember how a horse was Pappy one time. I rode a horse you know, once. It was a long time ago. And we got pictures of you on that horse. I'd been on a horse. It was pretty fun. <laughs> I rode Nana. Did high. you say you rode Nana? No, I put her on a horse and then I rode it. Oh, I thought you said you rode Nana. That's what it sounded like. It was, <laughs> big, it was a great big horse. I mean, a big horse. It was a stud. It was bigger than that, almost twice as big as that horse you was on. Well, I was a pony, I think, mm -hmm. or maybe it like a little like horse. It was up, up in the third floor of a building sitting down it. It was tall. You know, I've actually heard about a lot of celebrities. One of my favorite ones is Pappy. That's right, Betty. I will a celebrity. Not much of one. <laughs> John Wayne. <White. laughs> <laughs> <Or> nothing. <laughs> right. There was a while, man, old Clint Eastwood. But... No, now you're just talking. No. <laughs> me, and him, me and him uh, herded the cattle together. Oh, <laughs> raw hide? Yeah. Oh, you was on the show, raw mm -hmm. hide, black and white. How come I never hide? saw that? Oh, you, you would if you paid attention. I was on there. It was a TV show. It was on television in black and white. Yeah, I know what it is. Uh, that's a white boy. <laughs> Thank you, Pappy, for pointing that out to us. It's not like we take a look at you and see it. <laughs> <laughs>
Can you tell Pappy's white? What? Can you tell what Pappy's white? You know. Uh, yes, Pappy. Cut that thing off. Huh? We've talked enough. I didn't say nothing. I know, honey. You didn't say nothing. Why? Your cheeks are kind of red. Do you feel bad? I always feel bad. He always feels bad when he has to do stuff on YouTube. I always feel bad. Maybe he's embarrassed. He's just, feel... He is kind of getting a little red. He know. feels embarrassed. I, am... I feel embarrassed too if I sit late and tell all those <laughs> lies. <laughs> I'm being real embarrassed. So, um. I went happy... deep sea fishing one time. You did? Yeah. Was it a lot of fun? Yeah. I caught a fish. That long. No one can see your hands, Pat. Tell them how long. That long right there. Well, they need That's to estimate. 18 Pat. inches. Is everything eight? Well, 19 inches. <laughs> I got a riddle for you, Nina. No, it was 22 inches because you had to, they had to be 22 inches before you keep them. Uh, what kind was it? A fluke. Nina, Nina, I got a riddle for Fish you. Had that. Okay, be caught, Pappy. Okay, here's the riddle, okay? Okay, here's a riddle, Pappy. There are 20 cows. 28 chickens. That's 48. <laughs> How many cows didn't eat chickens? 20 cows didn't eat chickens because there was 28 chickens, so there was no chicken. It was eating. 10. Where'd you get 10 at? Wait, listen. 28. Chickens. Oh, 28 chickens. Well, that was pretty good. Ah. Well, that was pretty good. Where'd you hear that? Oh, I just messed up. Anyways, here's another one. Okay. There are three children in a family. Mm -hmm. Monkey Joe and Monkey Big Boy. <laughs> What's the other monkey's name? Monkey Little Boy. Yeah. Is Pappy. 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 <laughs> that other name was Pappy. <laughs> riddle me this and riddle me that. Pappy just knocked over a candlestick. My men Clinton's got to go one day. You went with the Clintons? Clint Eastwood. Old Rowdy Yates. The man with no... Okay, that's enough of that. Let's just wrap this thing up soon. Thank you for watching this episode of Pap's Talk Show. Uh, thank you. very funny today. Pappy don't feel good today. Well, he does, but he just doesn't have much of it. Do you, Pap? No. He wore himself out yesterday. With all those people here, oh, they just enjoyed the show. They wish they wish they could come by another time, but Pap didn't want like that because no, he was embarrassed. Right. But at least he didn't have any liver stories. <laughs> I'll tell you a liver story. Oh, no. Okay, let's end this thing, so... Bye bye, guys. Oh, let me tell. Take care. Let me tell you bye. a liver story. Pep, you have to say bye. Bye.